Okay, this is a uh, this is a leak uh, in a valley area here, um, and uh, we call these periodically on, on real estate deals because there's uh, issues with um, a blockage and debris getting in the valley, flashing under the tile in the valley. Uh, commonly mistaken for you know by a lot of people thinking that the the debris is on the on the on the top side of the valley now the real problem is under the valley and this is kind of what we have to do to to, uh, to remedy the situation you have to basically remove all the tile uh, surrounding or, or covering that valley area as they've done here and uh, to, to get down to where all the debris blockage is, has occurred also uh, there's a good chance that there's damaged felt paper under that valley where the waters actually penetrated through the uh, the subroof uh, uh, underlayment and uh, into the house. So first they have to clean out the valley, then they have to repair the damaged fell paper and uh, finally uh, close it back up. So this is a good example of how involved it, it actually is to, to deal with a, a valley issue on a tile roof. They're very common, uh, especially this is, this is a, uh, it's called an S tile. It's kind of a Spanish type of a tile. Uh, not as common on the S tiles, but more common on the uh, flat, the more flat style tile roofs. Uh, the blockage really, really gets gummed up on those because there's, there's, you know, they're flat and they lay in the valley. So here they have the uh, the valley all unbuttoned. It's just basically they took apart the whole puzzle, and uh, then then they're going to take care of the problem and button it back up.